Prince! Hey, over here. Prince, how are you going to do against Kobe today? Give him confidence, Prince. Right here, please. What further steps can you take to improve your game? Are you Prince. excited to play the Staples Center today? What are you going to say to your fans? Prince. You're late. It's all good. You're guarding Kobe at Staples, and you think this is some type of wreck game? Dad, Kobe's got to guard me, too. You gotta like that arrogant look off your face before Kobe does it for you. Having confidence is one thing, but you're not taking this seriously. I told you, enough. it's all good. I got this. Yeah, you got this. They're just about to head out there for warm ups. Go get dressed. So, not the last one strolling out there like some type of bomb. Whatever, man. And there's an aerial view of Staples Center, where we are set for a clash between two hometown teams. Welcome, everyone, to Staples Center here in downtown Los Angeles for an inner-city matchup between the Lakers and the Clippers. And they've got high hopes for their 18-year-old rookie, Prince. I love Prince, Mike. The future looking bright for the Clippers. Bucky Walker is in for the injured Shaquille O'Neal. Devin George takes the place of Rick Fox at small forward. And the veteran Robert Ory is in at power forward. And for the Clippers, Andre Miller is at the point in his first season with this team. Reporter David Alder. David. Thank you, Kevin. Now, Prince is the son of former NBA player Truck. He was drafted by the Celtics in the third round of the 1983 draft. Now, Truck was a worth monitoring. Guys? It will indeed, D.A. Terrific report as always, and thank you. So Prince can certainly back up his talk with his game, Clark. We've seen that. But the question remains, does he have the mental discipline to focus and do whatever it takes to help his team win? The Clippers selected Prince 12th overall in this year's draft. The 18-year-old came straight out of high school to the NBA. And Kicks it out to Prince. Down low, Olua Kandy. Beautiful pass by Prince. He's got a lot of potential as a playmaker. Smart play by Mike with Shaq out of the lineup. Rebounding has definitely been an area of emphasis for Kobe Bryant. Yeah, he's grabbed 10 rebounds in each of the Lakers' first two games. And he'll have to be just as aggressive on the boards tonight because the Clippers have a clear size advantage. Blazers after landing on somebody's foot following a shot attempt. Left the game in the second quarter, but he did come back and actually played pretty well, finishing with 25 points and 10 rebounds. And that shows just how tough Kobe is. He's willing to easy, smart basketball. Prince outside. Brand, a screen on Bryant. So much skill. D has to play Prince tight. Drew a foul that time. This is his first chance at the line tonight. That free throw, no good. And the Lakers making a change here. And he's good on the second. Kobe Bryant has had to shoulder the load for this team to start the season. Well, he's not your typical 23-year-old guy. I mean, he's averaging 26 points and 10 rebounds through the first two games, Kevin. But it's not translating to wins. This team simply does not have enough firepower or depth. Clippers with the rebound. Richardson for three. Good. And a nice assist from Prince him a chance to utilize those skills it can be a major positive it's Prince on the wing from the arc and it's Prince showing off his range Prince knows how lethal he can be on offense checked in for rush and it's Pargo in for shot Boy, I like that possession a lot you know get the ball inside with Prince and then force your way to the foul line be aggressive and a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Clippers. Look at the fast break point total from these guys coming off the pick and roll into perfect position to score. So far, Mike, the Clippers have to feel great about their decision to put Prince on Kobe Bryant. Absolutely. He's played hard. And he's making progress. He scrimmaged for the first time yesterday for about five minutes. Now, they're still uncertain about his return date. 
but it could be as soon as the end of this month. Guys? Thank you, David. That's good news. That's great news, in fact, for the Lakers. Mike, they have rebounded by Grant. He thought that one was going down as soon as it left his hands. Well, with good reason. That was a great look. Just bad luck it didn't go down. To confuse the defense. Prince with a screen on Fisher. To the paint. Here's McGetty. And he makes it look easy, dunking it hard with one hand. This is what Miller was brought here to do. He's there. Clippers getting the win against the defending champion Lakers, Mike.